Hi, welcome, Kate Bailey here. I'm the founder of Love Sober and the author of Love Your Sober Year and Love Yourself Sober, ICF trauma-informed coach, uh, specializing in all things gray area, drinking, sobriety, habit change, midlife and menopause. So lots of stuff going on here. And I would really like to talk to you a little bit about something that can really trip us up in our sobriety. You might have heard of fade effect bias. So what is that? Well, if any of you have tried to get sober, you might have found that it's kind of feels easier at the beginning sort of counterintuitively it's sort of hard work but there's something kind of like focused about it and you feel like you're kind of like going for it using all the muscle power and then at some point this kind of willpower runs out and can leave us really vulnerable to triggers um and at the beginning, obviously, we can remember what hangovers are like. We're like, I don't want that. I really don't want to feel like that again. It's hideous. So we're in a way, um, what we call our move away from goals are really, really strong. So they're very good motivators. So what we really want to do is um, create some really strong move towards goals at this point. And we don't, not just that, but we need to be nourishing our nervous system. So working holistically with our mindset, with working with the dopamine pathways with sober treats and rewards accountability being seen by other people really really good for um, our motivation tracking our progress nourishing our nervous systems and really making sure that we're working with our kind of feelings of uh, regulation but also uh, motivation and reward so um what I designed uh, is a three month group coaching program to really help with this because my sobriety really changed once I started to really understand not what just what I was supposed to not be doing, i.e. drinking, avoiding situations, um, just keeping going, keeping going. Of course, that's part of it in the early days. But all, then really realizing that I could work with my nervous system, I could work with, we call them glimmers, we'll go into that in the course, feelings of safety and connection, rewards, treats, motivation, our goals, our values, whilst we're going along this together and with accountability with other people. Now, as I said, I created a three month course, 12 weeks group coaching program with daily content, bite sized videos, audios, some written, um, depending on your learning preferences, there will be something accessible for you um, with a coaching call once a week where we meet to reflect on the week's um, materials and learning and the sober journey the challenges and the triumphs and so what we do is we go through uh, through these 12 weeks and I'm starting it again on the November the 3rd this year 2024 and it's a really great time because what it does is it takes us through that kind of holiday period when we're gearing up for Christmas, New Year, a lot of kind of social stuff going on, a lot of support we need to get on board around that time. And also through into dry January, we enter dry January feeling like, you know what, now everyone's on our team. Um, and then emerge at the end of January together in a really good space to thinking about the next steps that we want to take um, in 2025 with our best feet forward and feeling like nourished, replenished, regulated, supported positive you know to start creating the next steps on our sober path and what that might look like um plenty of support at love sober we have community where we can go to after that um but yeah so the love sober life school we look at um you know finding our feet establishing early habit change we look at boundaries and routines we look carefully at the nervous system and stress response neurobiology of stress how to manage stress because nine times out of ten the women that I work with are drinking because of stress related stuff and to try and dial things down or the social piece of people pleasing, fitting in socially, coping with socializing. So we look at that, we look at uh, social, being social and sober, sober in a drinking world, how we navigate that, what to say to people. We then dive into the science of happiness with all that good stuff that I was talking about earlier, positive psychology. And we also look at the hormonal piece because as we're going into our forties and onwards, we can experience dysregulation on a kind of very basic basic physical physiological level so the more we know about 
uh, that midlife transition and what's going on, the more we can, you know, and track, we can advocate for our needs um, because it is a, another situation that kind of comes in and can knock us off balance. So all of that. And then we look at how to some coaching tools with how to, you know, curate and create our next steps uh, for ongoing success. And really the idea with this is to make everyone kind of of us realize in a really tangible, practical, accessible way that there is this whole kind of world out there, whole smorgasbord of things that we can choose from um, to enjoy ourselves, to socialize, and we're never hampered by hangovers or feelings of self-loathing that we get, you know, when we've been drinking and have the anxiety. And this is really evidence-based and providing lots and lots of information. There's also a library of resources. So if you decided you liked a topic, you could dive right in. So TED Talks, blogs, books signposted. So really there's such a lot um, that we can access in this course. And again, it is designed for busy women. So the actual daily, um, you know, the daily exercises are just very uh, small bite size. So it can fit in, you know, five, 10 minutes of your day just to be building the repetition and that sober habit. And, uh, you know, that that kind of building blocks of, of the sober, sober muscle, if you like. So if you would like to find out more about that, please subscribe, but go off to lovesober.com. There's a drop down menu and you go to Love Sober Life School and all the details about joining will be there. If you come on soon, there's some early bird offers. Um, if you if you would like to come and join us, if you have any more uh, questions, then please feel free to drop me a line at kate at lovesober.com and we can and I can help answer any questions you might have. And I look forward to hearing from you.